Hi guys, welcome to the channel, quick general love reading for my friends Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus, so let's find out together what's coming through for you, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the love arena, let's see what we can get for you guys. Oh, loud shuffle. And we are ready now. So your energy is four of swords. Five of Wands, Queen of Wands, The Magician, your person's energy is Wheel of Fortune, King of Wands, Five of Swords, Hierophant, Meeting Energies, Ten of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Two of Swords, Four of Cups, Our Focus, Three of Swords, bottom of the deck, Two of Pentacles. A cycle, a situation that is dragging itself forward. It can be a matter of competition, guys, around your connection. King of Wands, Queen of Wands, powerful match, quite a fiery couple. There can be someone that is basically bringing an interference against your connection and it's like someone has to resist that interference, this strength card. Otherwise, the Three of Swords can kick in. This is a committed relationship, Ten of Pentacles. Hierophant vibe in some sense. I have to say that for some of you, your person can be extremely jealous of you guys. And if there is competition interested in you and you are super quiet, meaning that you are not uh, paying attention to other suitors, your person can see ghosts, you know? Look, ghost lens, boy. Bone collector, which is an energy about experiences for me. Making a choice, your person can fear that you can choose someone else over them, the two of swords, Coming apart, bottom of the deck, and encouragement. Let's consider it, guys. It can even be the strength card. So, the Four of Swords is interesting because it can even describe some of you that are evaluating other options. If you are dealing with a partner that can be possessive, jealous, you know, controlling, we have to be careful because they can basically work against themselves. Cupid's arrow. Have a fate, love is coming, surprise, invitation or meeting, hesitation, which is the seven of pentacles. Healing heart. Healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. Let's put the energy in perspective. We got the Three of Swords, someone can be disappointed. Self-indulgence, focus on self, self-worth, time to heal, shadow work, self-appreciation. Guys, let's put, um, let's put the issue in this way. If your person thinks that you are looking around for someone new, you can feel hurt because your person is basically questioning your loyalty. At the same time, if you are not uh, looking for someone else, your person doesn't entirely trust you because of a pattern that can be described perfectly by the Five of Swords. There can also be 
the opportunity for some of you maybe not exactly fulfilled in a connection like this one to look around because who knows maybe there can be someone better and your person can truly smell troubles now guys I gave to you three scenarios uh, that can basically fit in considering this set of energies you will have to evaluate if they can speak to you there can be a lot at stake considering the Ten of Pentacles and the Hierophant someone might not be interested in keep doing things as they are so far let's find out more let's start with your person uh, they get the Wheel of Fortune so there can be a time factor um, because it's like they can realize that the situation is um, getting out of their hands let's see the king of wands and the five of swords guys four of swords recurrent energy five of cups missed chance sadness disappointments five of pentacles feeling left out in the cold communication is not exactly something in favor of this connection guys because when you talk there can be a clouded interaction it's like the two of you cannot understand each other and if the topic of your conversations uh, is basically an interference from the outside um, you can argue let's see the five of swords here we go temperance working things out knight of wands king of cups your person fears a knight of wands interference and they are trying to understand if and how your connection can be saved granted the fact that they can still say that they love you they fear to be left behind this is fair to say let's see your perspective guys queen of wands and then let's go for the five of wands six of swords the magician again so some of you are going to make a decision about this connection let's see how the five of wands energy which can be a noisy and annoying one one about competition also uh, let's see how the energy can play out in this situation four of cups recurrent energy some of you can be on the receiving end of avances coming from other suitors but you are not pursuing that type of situation it's like your person can have trust issues and this can still be a problem for this connection the hermit if there are trust issues and your person is questioning your loyalty at the same time you can question the opportunity for you to remain to stay in this connection with this person ace of pentacles a big offer one that can lead towards the ten of pentacles legacy it can even be a new agreement especially if you are already committed or married but you can question the opportunity to share this new agreement with someone that basically uh, doesn't trust you that's why the juggling act the two of pentacles let's see in the meeting guys let's go for 
the seven of pentacles, time factor, page of wands, a flirtatious approach that can play against this connection. Let's see the four of cups and then the two of swords, six of cups, memories, eight of wands, Cupid's arrows, an old friend can be involved in this situation as the third person, it is fair to say that some of you might have received an offer from someone from the past. If you resonate, your person doesn't like that at all. And even if um, you didn't get serious, allow me to say, with the old friend, even if it was just a matter of words, your person can truly see ghosts, truly. Let's see the Two of Swords, guys. This is the crossroads that can uh, make or break this connection. Queen of Pentacles and the Queen of Swords. Bottom of the smaller deck, Three of Wands. There is going to be a conversation, Queen of Swords, about the opportunity to nurture this connection moving forward. It is not said that it can be done, guys, because it seems that some of you can look in a different direction. And it's like you can also say to your person that there can be someone else that can treat you guys better someone else that can even make you the offer that your person was not able to manifest you can even be married guys but it, it's like it's like a facade allow me to say no judgment coming from me but these energies these energies are a problem because your person fears the competition they fear to be left behind. They cannot stand the idea that you can talk with other people, even if it's just casual interactions, you know, everyday life's interactions. This person can see you as uh, one of their possessions, and this is a huge problem. Jealousy can eat them alive. It's a monster, truly. The green monster. Envy, even. Uh, they can be envious of the fact that other people can interact with you. But <laughs> this is the problem. At the same time, if you realize that your person truly works in this way, you might question the opportunity to stay with them. Jealousy and envy can be two monsters that can truly work against this person, guys. Suddenly they can become a sore loser. And even if you can say, look, it was nothing. It was nothing. They do not believe that. And if there is no trust, it's impossible to share love. So there is a choice coming up, guys. And considering the double magician, it's going to be your choice. Because it will come down to a vision about the future. This person... This person has multiple issues, unfortunately. But you cannot fix them for them, you know? 
So, guys, I hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful somehow, some way. Let us know if you resonate. Comment, like, share, subscribe to the channel. Until next time, I wish you the best. Take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon. Bye.